Greetings from the road, my doc kids, YouTube and Facebook friends. Um, this is a little 411. If you have a problem with the way I do a video, the content or the thumbnail or anything else, stick it up with the Lord because I do as I'm led to do. And sometimes you have to use bait to be able to catch flies or honey to catch bees. And I'll leave it at that. So if you want to stay part of my ministry, so it's not about me. It's about God. Just uh, keep your comments to yourself. If you want to complain, or take them to the Lord. It's not a democracy. It's what the Lord gives me and I put it out. So let's talk about today's video, shall we? Talked about NASA a day or two ago, where a lot of uh, conspiracy theorists are saying that NASA says that or, or that there's a huge asteroid is coming to hit the Earth. They say it is, and NASA uh, that will destroy the Earth. And NASA debunked that. I debunk it because the Holy Bible says the Earth will not be destroyed by asteroid. But I will tell you this much: an asteroid is coming, a big one. It's going to wipe out billions of people on the Earth. Let's rewind that. An asteroid is coming, a huge one. It's going to wipe out billions on the earth. This is a 100% verified fact because the Holy Bible says it is. During the tribulation slash great tribulation, an asteroid will come out of the sky and hit the oceans. It will destroy billions of people on the earth. It will wipe out uh, flora, fauna, animals, humans, rivers, lakes, streams, ocean life. It's going to just wreak havoc. And you can bank on that. I don't care what NASA says. <laughs> you can't debunk God's word. But here's the bottom line. Read Matthew 24. Read the whole Bible. The rapture is imminent. Any second of any day. Christ is going to break the skies, and when he does, all hell is going to break loose for seven years on earth, and those who are left behind, who are all the unsaved and most Christians as well, because the Christians won't repent of their sins, the way the Bible says at least two or three times that they have to, most Christians are Satan's cheerleaders, they'll be here for seven years of hell on earth, it'll just tear this world its foundations, and if God didn't intervene, all flesh would die, as it is about two-thirds of all humans will die, the most awful, grotesque, perfect death you can possibly imagine. Why go through all that? i got a prayer in the box, below the title. Pray that prayer and do those six final next steps as soon as possible because no one's guaranteed any more time in life. Also in that box is my trip survival guide video. It tells you I'll get saved during the trip, what to expect A to Z. If I'm to pray for you for anything, contact me and I will. True Christians, keep looking up. Our different girl and I will fly soon. Share this video with everybody possibly can, and let's get the word out, and let's get ready for the imminent rapture. Bye.